me like Welcome my fantastic subscribers, I am Captain Planet, welcome channel. Today I will be showing you my own devices, my own wicked device. It's wicked, it's so wicked. Basically all it does, it duplicates your rails guys, it duplicates your rails. You want to duplicate a rail? Come to duplicate your rail here guys. And what you do is you put it down on the green block and as you can see it will duplicate the rail. It will go into the water stream all the way back around to my hopper dropper dispenser kabobolator and it will then refill and restock my own inventory allowing me to put down as many tracks as and that's how it's done it's a f it's amazing if you like this please don't forget to like and subscribe it's very compact look at how it used to look yeah Ugh, Sarah, that's gross it had a lot of hoppers it was very hoppery it was very com it wasn't very compact so basically I ripped out all the hoppers and I replaced it and now it looks like this Three blocks. No, it looks like this. It has water in it and it basically takes care of all those hoppers. If you want to build this with me, what you're going to need are these things here. These are the items that I need. You would need the same. So we, I have 19 pieces of block of choice. I also have two half slabs. I have a red block, a green block, only three hoppers, two pistons, one lever, I nearly swore that, one lever, one bucket of water, and seven, only seven redstone pieces, one immovable block, I will use obsidian for this, but you guys can use ovens or whatever, two repeaters, and two comparators, and one dispenser, and that, that's it. It's, it, it, it's not a lot of things, it's not a lot to ask for, so now I have these things, let's get building, let's get c c cracking with the tutorial, I knew I was going to stutter, Okay guys, so I'm going to have two holes like this with two, two, two hoppers placed into each other like this. It's very simple. I've done it a million times before, but today it was a little bit harder. I don't know why. Okay, so I have a comparator facing out and I've also chucked a random item inside. I'm using a lever. Now I'm just going to put another comparator here like this. And put a redstone repeater in the front of that comparator. And give yourself a pat on the back because we're about 50% done. So you want a block of choice right here and here. And put a lever right here and turn the machine off. Okay. So now you can see you just want to get out some redstone pieces. We only need seven guys. Can I get a fa- And now I'm just going to put one piece here. One, two, three, four. Five and six. Right there guys, and now we're going to put a dropper down faced up, and guess what guys, we're going to get that last redstone piece out and whack it on top by crouch placing. And that's how you do that. So you can turn it on and off and you'll see that it will activate every facet and complexion needy. I'm just making up words now, I'm sorry. Okay, so put the red, no, it's green, put the green block down here, and your red block next to it, and break here and put a dropper, I mean a hopper, crouch place into that dispenser. Now you want to kind of get a quartz, a quartz slab or any type of slab. <laughs> You're a slab. Okay, and break a hole down and look up under the slab. Break the slab on the top of the slab. And you're done. And you cover it up and it goes black. Now you want to put a sticky piston on that redstone. And you'll see that it will react the moment it is in existence and now you want to do the same thing but you want to put a block of choice right here this is where we're going to put our next piston and just whack it there easily right like that and it should react easily and what else we need to do okay so now we want a block of choice which is immovable which i use a good obsidian okay so now obsidian won't move okay you want to put that there Okay, we're looking pretty good. All you want to do now is bring your stream around. So I'm going to use block of choice uh, as, as much as I can and just drag it all the way around making a, a some sort of water pool. So all your items will get flushed down and just bring it up ever so slightly, ever so carefully, all the way back up here and break it over here. I mean, bend it that way, right. Okay, so now you want to get out your bucket of water this is one of the final touches and you're done right there okay so when you when your items get thrown in there it will just you know 
done guys that's it so yeah let's try it out I'm gonna put it in survival and I'm placing my tracks down AFKly simply logically cerebromality intoxicating very cool I love this build it's very simple yeah I just did it guys I'm amazing I I hope I didn't accidentally copy anybody but um yeah I'm just using what I know and I I know what I use and I'm happy that I did so guys so I am Seraphim199 in case you forgot please like and subscribe I cry every time. Cry me a river, won't you? Okay, I'm going home now, guys. Um, I will be doing battle mode again. I have many other things I haven't shown you guys yet, but I'm getting on it.